When it comes to the health of those who are incarcerated or in jail, one of the nation's largest medical groups has issued new recommendations on how they can get better treatment. Here's the story. The United States has the highest number of incarcerated individuals worldwide and millions of patients receive their primary health care there. The American College of Physicians is issuing a new policy paper published in Annals of Internal Medicine with recommendations to reduce health disparities and support the unique needs of these individuals. ACP has a long-standing commitment to the delivery of health care for all Americans and opposes any form of discrimination, including those who are incarcerated. Many incarcerated patients are coping with significant unmet health care needs, including chronic medical conditions, infectious diseases, substance use disorders, and mental health conditions. Over 40% of inmates report being diagnosed with a mental health problem. Caring for these patients should include screening for mental health conditions and substance use disorders at intake and appropriate treatment for those who need it. ACP calls for proper financing across the entire incarcerated population. ACP recommends that the U.S. jail and prison system be adequately funded to ensure timely access to proper and necessary health care. This includes addressing health care needs specific to women, LGBTQ+, and aging patients. ACP believes that more needs to be done to make sure that people released from jail or prison are able to continue to access health care and social services once they return to their communities. ACP is committed to working towards fully understanding and supporting the unique needs of the incarcerated population, eliminating health disparities, providing equitable health care services, and ensuring continuity of care once they return to their communities. For more information, go to acponline.org.